The sixth grade Rainbow River trip is a culmination of their studies on Lake Watch, where they test different factors and how they influence different water bodies, and it's also their introduction to aquifers. In this trip, they swim a total of about a mile and a half through Florida's aquifer system because they're swimming through springs that are bringing water from the aquifer all the way up to ground level. And they get to see the different flora and fauna, the living creatures inside this river and see how the interactions affect their lives. They also get to put forth their knowledge about how human factors can influence these areas and what needs to be due to keep these areas preserved and safe for generations to come. This connects to what we're learning in science because it's like, it's lake stuff. We're learning mostly about lakes and springs and the aquifer, stuff like that. Humans and plants affect how much DO is into water, which is kind of like oxygen, fish. what the pH is, and it's really cool. The trip is so important because not only do we get to study aquifers and Lake Watch uh, from Lake Lipsy on campus and from different experiments and different things in class, but we get to see firsthand how the water actually works, how the water comes out of the ground. We get to feel the speed at which it comes out of the ground, see the fish, see the organisms that depend on it. It's an incredible trip that I think they appreciate even more because of their knowledge in these subjects. It gives you a more hands-on experiment. You just, you just see what you're learning. It's a lot better than like watching a video or like hearing some words. Okay.